Hey guys, what's going on? It's King Clutch here, and today guys, we're back in the NBA 2K20, and today what I'm going to do is I'm going to show you guys how you can build Kevin Love here in NBA 2K20, guys. Now, this is going to be my final build video, I'm pretty sure, of 2K20. It's been a great, you know, year. I've been loving doing these builds for you guys. It's been awesome. So this is going to be the last one. This is going to be Kevin Love for you guys today. So what you want to do is make this build a power forward right-handed jersey number zero. Again, the handedness in the jersey number does not matter, um, but I would make this build a power forward, guys. So we're going to go ahead and hit continue on that. Now for the skill breakdown for this Kevin Love build, guys, I'm going to go with the shooting and the finishing i feel like kevin love is more of an offensive player than defense i feel like he's definitely you know more known for his shooting ability you know he's a good facilitator pretty good facilitator for a power forward and everything so we're gonna go with this one so for this skill breakdown again this is just kind of my opinion whenever i create like big big men i always prefer this balanced pie chart i just feel like it's the best thing overall i would say kevin love is pretty you know balanced in general when it comes to his physical attributes between his vertical and speed strength so I would say you might as well go balanced. Um, you could definitely make an argument maybe for maybe the pure speed chart if you wanted or maybe one of the strength charts. Um, but I'm just going to go with a balanced chart. I feel like it's the best overall option. So we're going to go with this one. Now, when it comes to these skill breakdowns for these attributes, I'm going to go ahead and upgrade most of this finishing stuff. And um, we're going to want to get this as high as we can. I'm actually going to leave my post hook here at a 70 just so we can kind of divvy up these attributes a little bit more. But I'm going to want to upgrade the shooting stats. This is an obvious one. Kevin Love can definitely shoot. So we're going to max all those out. Now, what I'm going to do is upgrade all of this playmaking stuff. Um, that's an obvious. We want to be able to play, maybe we want to be able to pass. I feel like the post moves and the post fade on a Kevin Love build are pretty important. Then we're going to up, want to upgrade our interior D and then our lateral quick. Then I'm going to take this offensive rebound up to a 35 and then this defensive rebound will just leave there at a 60. So overall, this is going to give me 17 finishing badges, 21 shooting, 17 playmaking, and one defensive badge. Now I know this build defensively, um, badge wise, it's not very, it's not very well rounded when you consider in defense, but I feel like Kevin Love is more of an offensive style player. Anyways, you know, he's more looking to score the ball, pass the ball, do things like that. So I'm going to go with this. Overall, we got a pretty good offensive style big man here, so we're going to run with that. Now, for the body shape, again, this doesn't matter. We're going to go with the find. Again, this doesn't really have any impact on your player. We'll go with that. Now, Kevin Love is 6'8", so we will go with 6'8". Now, he is listed as 250. You can definitely make this build 250 if you want. It'll definitely help out your strength. What I'm going to do is just go up a little bit. We'll go up to 233, so that'll help boost our strength a little bit, our interior D. We don't lose as much vertical and excel, though. So we'll just go with 233. And then for the wingspan, I'm going to minimize this. I want to be able to get the best possible shooting stats we can. So we're going to go with this 80-inch wingspan here. And now for the takeover, we can even get playmaking takeover on this build. You can get slashing, spot-up shooter, or post scoring. Now, I feel like for a Kevin Love build, it'd either be spot-up shooter or post scoring. You can take either of these. I'll go spot-up shooter. I feel like that's kind of his thing, you know, shooting from deep, shooting from threes, being a power forward that can shoot the ball. So we're going to go spot-up shooter, but you can make an argument for post score or two. You can definitely do that. I'm just going to go with the spot-up shooting takeover. As you can see, we're going to get a mid-range finish to Gallinari, Larry Johnson, and Kevin Love. Now, he's listed last, but at least his name is up there, guys. So I feel like this is a pretty good Kevin Love build. I'm going to go over and show you guys the badges I would throw on this build. Bumping this up to a 99 for this one defensive badge. There's a lot of things you could do. I'm just going to put this on Intimidator. Again, we only have one, so it's pretty limited on where we could put with that. So I'm just going to leave it there. Now, for these playmaking badges, guys, I'm going to put Quick First Step on gold, Post Spin Technician on gold, uh, Dream Shake on gold. I feel like Bailout's very important with this build. I'm going to put Unpluckable up the silver, and then also I'm going to add Break Starter on gold just so we're able to, you know, get outlet passes and throw those. Now, with this last one, there's a lot of things you could do. Um, I, you can really put it wherever. I'll just put it up the Bailout, but you could put it a lot of things. This way, we have lots of playmaking badges. We can definitely, you know, not get the ball stripped, and we're able to, you know, dribble pretty well for a power forward. So, we're going to go with that. And for these shooting badges, I'm putting Quick Draw on Silver again. That's just where I like my Quick Draw. You can put it wherever you like. Range Ascender up the Hall of Fame so we can shoot from deep, space out the floor. That's very important. I feel like uh, Kevin Love definitely needs catch and shoot, and I'll throw a corner up here just so we're able to get that statistic boost there. That I up the silver. Now I'm also going to add deep fades. Kevin Love can definitely shoot some fades, so that's an important one to use. Hot Zone Hunter up the silver would be nice as well. Pick and Popper. Kevin Love's going to be set in screen, so we're going to want that. And then Volume Shooter is another badge. And then Slippery Off Ball. You could you definitely use that because you know you're going to be running away from the ball. Necessarily, you're not going to be the one dribbling the ball. Slippery Off Ball. You should be able to help get open. Um, but we'll just use that there. And again, you don't need to necessarily use that. That was just an idea. I feel like that's how it resembles how Kevin Love plays. But you could throw that on any of these other ones um, if you'd like. You can even throw a volume shooter to Hall of Fame. There's a lot of things you could do, but this is what I would do for the shooting badges on this Kevin Love build. Now, when it comes to these finishing badges, um, I'm going to put Contact Finisher on Hall of Fame. If you have the ability, you might as well put it as high as you can. So we're going to use that there. I'm going to put Bat Down Punisher up the gold, Fancy Footwork on silver, Relentless on silver, Slithery on silver, and then Consistent on silver. Now with these last two, I feel like for a Kevin Love build, Putback Boss could be helpful just so you're able to do putbacks. 
Um, you could leave that on bronze. And then with this last one, you could definitely use pick and roller, drop stepper, deep hooks. There's a lot of things you could do. It really just depends more towards your play style. Cross key score and acrobat too. So I'll just use it on pick and roller. But this way we're able to have a good, you know, variety of finishing badges, offensive badges. We can finish, we can shoot. We can do pretty much everything offensively. So overall, this is a definitely a great offensive four guys. It's a great offensive build to have. But again, I want to thank you guys too for all the support you guys have shown me over these 2K20 build videos, guys. We'll have more 2K21 builds coming up here most likely tomorrow if everything works well with the prelude. But anyways, guys, I hope you guys enjoy this NBA 2K20 Kevin Love build video. Ben King Clutch here. Hopefully you guys enjoy the video. Anyways, have a great rest of your day and peace out, guys. Thanks.